Hello everyone, in this video we will discuss about setw function for formatting output in C++. When writing C++ programs, it is often necessary to format the output in a specific way. When writing C++ programs, it is often necessary to format the output in a specific way to make it more readable. One way to do this is to use the setw function which is provided by the C++ standard library and is defined in the iomanip header file. If you want to use setw function in a program then we have to define iomanip header file. The setw function allow you to set the width of the output field when printing data to the console. This means that you can control the amount of space allocated for each output value. Making it easier to read and understand, the purpose of setw function is to provide a flexible way to format the output of your program and to make it more user friendly. By using setw function, you can ensure that your output is neatly aligned and properly spaced which can be important when dealing with large amount of data. setw function can be used in combination with other formatting functions also. The syntax of setw function is setw and function takes an integer argument. The setw function takes an integer argument that specifies the width of the output field. Now in this case n is a integer value that represents the desired width of the output field. Let's see the complete code how to use setw function in a program. Inside the main function first of all we have to declare one variable. A is a variable of integer type and assign value 3 to 1 then after that use setw function see out setw function setw function takes integer value that represent the desired width of the output field setw 15 so setw 15 sets the width of the output field to 15 character then print the value of a insertion operator the name of the variable now run this code now after the execution of this code the output is 3 to 1 notice that the output field has been padded with spaces to fill the full 15 character width this is because setw function sets the minimum width of the output field but does not affect the actual content of the output and by default output is right aligned within the output field. You can also use the left and right manipulators to specify the alignment. For example, to left align the output within the field, you can use Cout insertion operator, then left manipulator. Now run this code. Now the after the execution of this code, the output is left aligned and by default output is right aligned. Another important feature of setw function is that it affects only the next output value that is printed. This means that you can use setw function multiple times to set the width of different output field in the same line of code. Suppose we have two variables a and b. The value of a is 3 to 1 and value of b is 
सिक्स फाइव फोर फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल प्रिंट द वैल्यू ऑफ ए देन आफ्टर दैट सेट डब्ल्यू फिफ्टीन एंड देन प्रिंट द वैल्यू ऑफ बी ना इन दिस केस वी यूज सेट डब्ल्यू फिफ्टीन टू वाइस टू सेट द विथ ऑफ टू आउटपुट फील्ड इन द सेम लाइन then after the execution of this code the output is 3 to 1 and 654 by default the output is right aligned you can also use the left and right manipulators to specify the alignment like left then insertion operator left then insertion operator run this code now in this case the output is left aligned 3 to 1 and 654 by default the output is right aligned notice that each output field is 15 character wide and the value are aligned within their respective field this is all about set w function in c++